Breaking news. Hmm. They are simply criminals who believe in Nigerians' unity. Laye Mohammed compares IPOB to Boko Haram and bandits. Says bandits is better. <laughs> that is the Minister of Information that has no information whatsoever. Now in his opinion, in his heart and in his heart of hearts, says the Boko Haram, yeah? The bandits, Fulani headsmen, are better. This is this is his words, not mine, no, than IPOB. He said they are just criminals. Criminals that can shoot down an aircraft are just criminals. Criminals that rape people, kill them, dismember them, ask for ransom, you know, brutalize children and destroy the nation are just criminals. Are just simple criminals that can go to the military base of the country. NDA and commit all forms of atrocity, kill policemen and soldiers, I mean to say, and carry others away and ask for ransom are just criminals. IPOB are the real danger people. Yes, people should be worried and scared when they hear IPOB. <laughs> Nigeria. Ah, the laws have changed. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe if this is your first time. Thank you. The Commissioner for Information, Minister for Information, Halaji Nai Mohammed, have shocked everyone, saying that Boko Haram bandits are simple criminals who believe in the unity of Nigeria compared to IPOBs. The Minister of Information and Culture, Halaji Nai Mohammed, has said the indigenous people of Biafra and Boko Haram insurgents cannot be compared to bandits. Mohammed said the bandits are incomparable to IPOB because they cannot be attacked, they cannot be attached to a religion or an ideological goal. According to him, armed bandits wreaking, wreak havoc across the northwest part of the country. They are just simple criminals who believe in the unity and sovereignty of Nigeria. The minister spoke on TVC this morning, this Monday morning. He said the difference between IPOB and the bandit is that why IPOB are driven by ideology, I believe that they won't want to be part of Nigeria. Bandits have no flag, so the flag is the criminal element. Ah, bandits have no flag. Bandits are simple criminals. See how he puts it. That's why they will never declare them as terrorists. There are no difference between bandits and other criminals in the country. Bandits have never said they don't believe in Nigeria. They are just pure criminals. Daily Post report that Mohammed's statement is coming less than 10 days after he denied that there is preferent treatment between the groups, advocating that separationists in the country and bandits should be bandits are more friendly, better than IPOB. This is the Minister of Information, and this is the kind of ideas he carries. This is the way he sees and perceives life. This is this, you know, phenomenon with regards to what is happening now. Why IPOB to him are the real people the federal government should deal with? Bandits are simple criminals. Did you hear the terms? Simple criminals. Simple, simple criminals. Wake up, Nigeria. You know why? Because they created this abnormality. Oh, yes, they did. They created this whole banditry thing. They created it. They knew what was happening. Ebele, good luck, Jonathan, may win the election. And what did they do to ensure that he does not win it? What have they gone to do? They created the whole artificial first kidnap of school students. And you guess what, my people? What goes around, come around. Anybody who digs a pit will definitely fall into the pit. Today, President Muhammad Buhari, you know, as we speak, we heard that he paid 20 million naira to bandits so that they don't shoot down his plane. You know, so when you look at it, who exactly is deceiving who? We say we have a government who cares for the people. Oh, relative care is relative at this point in time. What do you mean care for the people? Are they not after their own, their own perspective? Are they not after things that they think will better or, 
you know, better profit them rather than the people. You call them simple criminals. Why the others? For saying they want out. That is the big crime. You know, we can't go very far with this same set of mind of people. If there is a disagreement, what are the terms of disagreement and how do we solve it? If there is a disagreement whatsoever, it is a call for people to sit together and look at it. Why are we having differences? Why? What could we do? How can we change this? What can we do to ensure that these differences are resolved? It's as easy as that. It's as easy as that. Why are there differences? What can we do? That's just how to go about it. Honestly, that's just what to do. Rather than, yeah, putting issues, make, you know, making out issues that ought not to be. It ought not to be. This is what is going on. Sunday Boho, Nandi Kanu are the criminals, yes? Why the real criminals are out there? The real criminals are out there. How do we, how, where did we even get here with a lot of lies and all those things that are going on? With all these things going on, how did we even get a set of people who are full of lies and everything? When did we get here? Why so much lies? These things ought to change. People are not honest. People are not really sincere. Everywhere, you know, it's wrong. Is wrong. It's 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 a wake up call and a reality check of what Nigerian government believe, and why we must not allow those who do not want progress of this nation to be at the end of affair. And that's why we've got a call of duty. When it is time for election, please don't sit back and allow them do all the all the make all the decisions. You have a decision to make. I have a decision to make. Can we make a decision that will not allow them infringe on our fundamental human rights? God, that goes a long way. When we decide on that ground, then we stick together and we detect what happens next. We don't allow these people to continue to derail and distract and cause a lot of havoc. Because the laws they bring is what favors them largely. Leave us a comment. We really love to hear from you. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless you. Have a good day. Bye for now.